Good morning, Key Stage 2. How is everybody this morning? I'm just going to wait just a couple of moments just to wait for some of you to join me. And then we will get started. Lots and lots of celebrations to do today. Hello, big hello to everybody who's doing all their amazing home learning. If you're tuning in this morning or watching this later on, a big hello to you. Big hello to those of you over in Educare. Good morning to you. And of course, our lovely year sixes who are in school and obviously some of you who are um, at home at the moment. So a big good morning to you as well and anyone else who is watching. Okay, so I'm going to kick things off this morning because we've got lots of celebrations to do. First things first, I am going to say a big happy birthday to a few people um, who have their birthdays this week. So first of all, I would like to say a really big happy birthday um, to Eva. So Eva, who's in Holly class, um, it is your birthday this week. So a massive happy birthday to you. And I hope you have the most amazing time celebrating. Also, uh, we have Connor in Hazel class. Connor, I believe it's your birthday this week as well. Very exciting. I actually know it's your birthday because you have told me. Um, so a big happy birthday to you this week. Um, and also Oliver in Maple class. Um, I hope that you are having uh, the most amazing week so far and a really big happy birthday um, to you this week as well. So happy birthday to all those people. I hope whether you're in school or at home um, that you are making the most of your birthday this week. So your adults around school have been nominating you for various different reasons, lots and lots of different reasons this week uh, for some wonderful celebrations. So I am going to kick off with um, our lovely Beach and Holly class in year four um, for those reasons that have come from some children who are an educator in school and also some of those children who are working really hard at home as well. Big well done to you because I know that can be really tricky. Um, so a really, really big well done to the following people. So starting off, we're going to start with the first person from Beach Class who's been selected by Mrs. Hansen is Faith. So big well done, Faith. Um, Mrs. Hansen says you've been working really, really hard um, and well on your literacy work um, in Educare. And she's super, super impressed with the work you've been producing. So a really big well done to you, Faith. Keep up the great work. Also from Beach Class, um, we have Anna, Anna G. Um, Mrs. Hansen said that you've sent some outstanding pieces of literacy and numeracy work. So you should be really, really proud um, of your hard work there that you've been completing from home. So really big well done to you, Anna. So you superstar. Keep up the great work. Also, um, somebody who is in school at the moment is Amelie. Amelie and Beach Class, well done to you, Amelie. Big round of applause for you as well. Um, Mrs. Hansen says, you've been providing some really, really super answers in your reading comprehension work. So that is absolutely fantastic, Amelie. Keep up the great work. Moving on to our lovely Holly class. Mrs. Hansen has chosen our lovely Solly. So, Solly, I know I saw you the other day. It was so wonderful to see you at the gate. Um, Mrs. Hansen says you have not only been completing some your home learning tasks, but you've also had the most positive attitude um, to your home learning. So, and I can agree with that because you were just so smiley and positive the other day when I saw you. So, well done to you, Solly. Keep up the great work, you superstar. Also, in the Holly class, um, we've got Esme. Now, Esme, I know this because I've also seen you over um, in Educare. You've been working independently on your maths work um, and really it's sort of achieving some great success there. So a really big well done to you, Esme. Keep up the great work. Um, and last but not least is our lovely Jamie. Now, Jamie, um, Mrs. Hansen says that you've been challenging yourself to do your best in all the work that you've been undertaking in Educare. So you should feel really proud of everything that you've been doing. Keep it up. Good job, everybody. Well done, my lovely year fours. OK, moving on. We have our lovely year fives from Maple Class. 
So I've got two names that Miss Shepherd has nominated, and then I've got one name who's over in Educare um, that the adults over there have selected. So first of all, I've got our lovely Deandra. Uh, Miss Shepherd has said that you are cons uh, consistently producing some really excellent work. She's super impressed with the work you've been producing. So keep it up. So well done to you, Deandra, you superstar. Also, another young lady that I, I know I've uh, celebrated some things before with her is Violet. So Violet, a really big well done to you in Maple class for all the amazing work you've been doing. Miss Shepherd said to keep up the great work. Um, she's been very impressed with you as well. So really well done to both of you. Now, last but not least from Maple Classroom is our lovely Sky. Now, Sky, I've been told you've not only been producing some amazing work in Educare, but also that you've been really, really resilient. So you keep trying, even if you find something a little bit tricky, you keep trying and trying again and again. Um, and I just want to say a big well done to you because that's really important that even if we find something a little bit tricky, that we try and we try again. And it doesn't matter if we get it wrong. It's all about us trying. So well done to you, Sky. You superstar. Um, moving on to year sixes. Now I've got some people who are in school with us at the moment, and the adults around school have selected some um, some of you uh, for some very special reasons, which I'm going to go through. And also, I've chosen a couple of people who are working at home um, that have just astounded me with some of their home learning. So I'm going to start off uh, with a message from Miss Woodley. Now, Miss Woodley, who's been teaching uh, design tech, she has said that Brooke, uh, so that's uh, Brooke W, um, has demonstrated some amazing artistic skills uh, based on a study of Rosalind Monks. She's concentrate, concentrated really hard on the details of her drawings um, and she's been very, very impressed with your level of concentration. So Brooke, if you're watching from downstairs or if you're watching later, you absolute superstar, well done. Also, I've got Miss Tourner. Now Miss Tourner has chosen two individuals and she has said that their focus and their determination in French has been just wonderful. So I'd like to say a really big, big well done to the following. Lydia, and I know Lydia will be watching. Lydia, you absolute superstar. Well done to you. I think Miss Tour was uh, Miss Tourner was so, so impressed um, with how hard you've been working and how committed you've been in your French lessons. So you should be really, really happy about that. And also to our lovely Louis. Now, Louis, I've also been told that your focus and determination in French has also just been fantastic. So you should feel super proud as well. So big round of applause to both of you. I would like to choose um, somebody, well, two people actually, who have really impressed me with their home learning. So first of all, I'd like to choose Giorgio. Now, Giorgio, um, I was going through a lot of his work um, over the last uh, week or so, and he just keeps sending me some of the most amazing home learning work. Um, so Giorgio, please keep it up. I'm really impressed with you, really proud of the work you're producing. And it's just been absolutely lovely to read. So well done. Thank you, Georgie. Also to Brooke T. Um, Brooke T has also been handing me some amazing work. I particularly liked your description um, of August in Wanda, where you talked about his thoughts and feelings uh, about starting his new school and going on a tour. So well done, Brooke, for that. Miss Dunn, uh, Miss Dunn would like to nominate our lovely Rowan. Now, she wrote a beautiful message um, just saying that she's so happy uh, with Rowan. He's displayed some beautiful and brilliant maths knowledge that has shown um, excellent use of the projector to measure and draw angles in maths. Um, he has been really positive um, and has been working really, really hard. And it's been great to have him back. So uh, well done to Rowan, you absolute superstar. Also, Miss Bray, she has selected our lovely Kiana. And she said that Kiana has shown great commitment and has been trying really, really hard um, in all her dance sessions. So well done to you, Kiana. Keep up the great work. I've seen the videos and it looks fantastic. Really well done. Um, and also, uh, Miss Courtauld, 
um, has selected this young lady and this deserves a really big round of applause. Um, so if you're uh, with this young lady at the moment, I want you to give her a big round of applause afterwards. Um, this is for Olivia. OK, so Olivia, um, who's usually in Elm class, uh, she's down in the beach bubble and Miss has said that she's had fantastic attitude. The way that you've settled back into school has been wonderful. You've been trying really hard and produced an excellent diary entry in literacy. Um, you're so very, very happy and smiley and helpful. And it's been delightful to have you in that group. So big well done to you. Super. So some really, really amazing things going on, both at home and in school. And we are all so, so super impressed with how hard people are working. So keep it up. So that leads me on to our adults. So last week we had Miss Bray. Uh, and we said a big thank you to Miss Bray for all the work she's been doing. So I'm going to do somebody else this week. So let's have a look. Who is it going to be? Okay, um, who is it? Okay, and we've got Miss Tornair. So, I don't know if Miss Tornair is watching, but she probably will be watching if she's not watching at the moment. But we'd like to say a really big special thank you to Miss Tornair. So, not only has she been super helpful um, around school working with the Year Six Bubble team, but also Miss Tornair has been doing some excellent French lessons uh, with our year sixes at the moment. Um, so Miss Tornet, I know you've been working really, really, really hard with our year sixes, um, preparing them ready for year seven, um, developing their language skills. So big thank you for that. Um, and I also know that you've been working with the, the secondary school children as well. So you're a very, very busy lady, um, but a really big, big thank you to you um, if you're watching. I hope that you get this message. So everybody, um, those of you at home, those of you in school, I'd like to say um, for you to have a really lovely week. I think we're going to have some really lovely weather this week, which would be lovely. Um, so whether you're in school doing your um, home learning uh, or whether you're out, outside of school doing your home learning, um, stay safe. And I look forward to seeing you all next week. Bye bye. <laughs>